Welcome back everybody. I'm Happy Tangent and we're playing Vampire. Let's get this thing rolling. Uh, we're gonna left off talking to Doc here, which I guess I'm a doctor as well, but... Would let's... you be so kind as to leave the room? Oh, well, okay, never mind. We're not gonna talk Can to him. Can I have some privacy, please? Privacy? We know he's uh, an intellectual when he says it that way. It's locked, all right. All right. So, where we last left off, um... If Swansea is not my attacker, it means somebody else came here tonight. Someone must know something. Uh, okay. Do they mean they know something? Uh, quick sweep. Alright, let's uh, see if anybody has any other things to say. Evening, sir. Can I help you? I have a few questions for you. <sighs> well, if you must. Come on, Sabrina. I want the truth! Okay, so maybe now that we talk to Swansea, they have a little more to say. I spoke to Dr. Swansea. He's not the man I'm looking for. Now, I want the truth. The truth? What do you mean? I suspect that someone else was here tonight. And I don't think Tom wants to tell me about it. I'm just the barmaid here, okay? If Tom says you're the only visitor we had, then you're the only visitor we had. I can feel your fear, madam. Please, tell me what's going on. <sighs> it's Will. William Bishop. He came in here earlier tonight and he... Well, I thought he was going to clock someone. Hmm. What happened tonight? He, he was dead drunk as usual. But my God, his, his, his eyes. His face. He must have caught something awful. He shouted and, and cried. It was terrible. Why are you so afraid? I mean, his skin. His hands. I scrubbed every glass and every chair that he touched. God, I hope it's not contagious. Tell me about this William Bishop. Will was a sailor who worked at the cannon factory. I just realized I could rotate it. A nice bloke, really. He's never been violent. Until tonight. Why keep it a secret? Why not tell me about it? Tom's nothing if not loyal. After Will lost his job, he offered him one ear. They used to be good mates. But recently, well... Will started to get very aggressive. I see. Thank you for your candor. I'll be sure to talk to Tom. Thank you, Sabrina. And now we got some details about Tom Watts. Just gonna, just so I can learn more about this stuff. Where is Mr. Tom? There's Dyson Delaney. There's old Tom Watts. So, it makes you wonder how you earn this XP from him. Oh, he's fatigued. These two are healthy. Just a little quick here. Just want to see what it says. Tom and William Bishop used to be good friends. Alright, cool. Excuse me, Sabrina. Here's Mr. Dyson. Hello, Dyson sir. Delaney. May I disturb you again? You're still so ugly as shit. Hey, hey! Has anybody? Can't say. Sorry. This is important, sir. Skipping. I don't know, and I. Because he's repeating. Himself. I'll leave you. That's. I wouldn't. I wouldn't skip if they weren't repeating. So. This guy's gonna. Welcome something. back. Did you find what you were after? I can't say I have. A terrible view. Are you sure no one else came into your bar before I arrived? Hey, I told you, you were the only other stranger I've had. <laughs> Okay, as a vampire, you can force a citizen to reveal information thanks to a hint you have discovered. Blue prompt. Talk about William! Or talk to me about William. Tom, talk to me about the visit from your old friend, oh, William. He just yes, forced we'll mind trick that guy. But he's not my Jedi friend anymore. Trick. Why lie to me if he is not your friend? I didn't lie. I said you were my only unannounced customer, and that's the truth. Hey, Tom, Who settle down. Don't get so hostile. Just an old sailor who loves his gin too much. He worked for years at the canning factory before it closed. Is he dangerous? Yeah. Like many drunks, he's all bark and no bite. He can barely stand up most of the time. How was he tonight? Was he different? Oh, sicker than usual, perhaps. He whined and mumbled about how mean people were to him and how he'd like to talk to me outside and then he left when I refused. I need to find him. It's a matter of urgency. Do you know where he is? 
You could try his boat. It's up by the North Pier. He sleeps there when he's too drunk to get home. Please describe him to me. What'd you expect? He's a tall, sick bastard with a bad rash and torn old clothes. <laughs> William used to be strong. Now he's a mess. Thank you, Tom. If you see him, tell him I don't want him back here unless he cleans up his act, okay? You got it, Tom. Thank you for the information, even though I forced it out of you. Alright. Don't have shit for XP. Let's just double check the map. Alright, it wants us to go off off here to the uh, left. So, we've been up that way. Let's just take a real quick look up here. Make sure they don't put any shillings hiding around here. Alrighty. We are rich man. If I ever revealed the, the man, intrigue. I wouldn't have to work hard. Britons working together. Skilled workers in engineering and kindred trades enroll today as war munitions volunteers. Support the men at the front with plentiful supply of munitions. You will not suffer in wages. Get into the factory line and feed the firing line. What's being done to me? To the city? Right. This is where they want us. Oh, okay. I wouldn't even look at the compass up top. 22 meters away. That means we're going to run up. Oh, I thought that was a run button. Oh, I'm so used to pushing that as a run button, but it never worked. And it still doesn't work in this game either. This one does, though. Okay. Alrighty, quick sweep. Alright, see, now it vanished because we have reached our destination. Inspect the boats. Any drunk guys laying in the boats? There he is. Alright, well, that means we're going to sweep across the others first. An old drunken Tom, or, or William Bishop. He's dead, it looks like, is my guess. The body is still warm. This man has just oh, been he's probably, drained he's of blood. Oh, he's probably not William. Examine wounds, Alfred, pick up no. Let's just go with the uh, wounds. This corpse has been dried of its blood, just like the previous victim. He even got some arm guards on. This man was armed. He tried to defend himself. Read his note. What's this? Some sort I guess of we had the option to examine the boat too, but I usually don't pick the bottom option first. All right. Prywin orders. You know what? We're gonna pronounce it Prywin until I find different. Thirtieth of October from G. McCullen to the Dock Patrols. Object: Multiple deaths in the dock regions. We believe a nasty leech is involved. Leeches as meaning vampires. Locate the beast, purge it, in quickly. Warning, according to recent reports, the vampire is very violent. Approach with extreme caution. I know we lack men in this part of town, but don't send rookies to investigate the cause if, or case. If I'm correct, we've got a frenzied one killing each night. As always, search abandoned places first, like old houses, basements, sewers, or warehouses. Destroy the leech, brothers. These Who you calling a leech? They're a company of profesh blood and empty gin bottles. Oh, I probably skipped his dialogue Bishop there. Fellow is something of a heavy drinker. Alright, move on. There are blood splats on the other side of the canal. I must reach that barge. Well, let's use our little nightcrawler. Uh, no, that's gonna, I was gonna say that from now on the whole game. Bamf! Little, uh, little factoid. Nightcrawler from the X-Men. Apparently, when he teleports, it smells terrible. Just sorry, just going on a tangent. All right, there's where they want us to go. That means we're gonna run to the end of the hall. I bet you it's combat. Yep, there we go. Let's see here. We got our got our little square button, triangle for our snake, X to bite. Ooh, dang! I was gonna miss both of these. Maybe I should use my uh, every time I go into a room, do one of these real quick. Hunter resistances, okay. Uh, and then R1 is my little bomb. Opportunity out of combat silently behind him. Don't you turn around? Turn around. Is it have a prompt? Stop. Yeah, give it to me. I guess we don't even need any. Oh dang it! I did it again. I gotta stop doing that. I don't know what game I've played recently. That uh, has me hit R1 so often. Alright, got some bullets for once. Range weapons equip 
and press triangle to use ranged weapons and inflict both standard damage and stun damage. Be aware the ammo is limited. Ammunition crate. Good. Uh, I may need a lot of bullets. Okay, it looks. To I feel be... like I'm back on the front line again. It, uh, looks like it reloaded itself. I'm not gonna attempt to use it now. All right, testing it. It's locked. Yep. Okay. I gotta start trusting that red circle. Oh shit. Do a quick view as a vampire. Thought I saw something shiny here. See, it doesn't show up that good. All the more reason to shut down this Alrighty, can we go up here? Oh crap! What are you? Can I go up higher and drop on this guy? Doesn't look like we're just gonna go straight at him. <laughs> I uh, scared him with my fireworks. Okay. Oh, one shilling. Come on. Oh, and after watching some of my videos, I gotta come up with a new catchphrase. I say that come on too much. Okay. That was it. That's really all we got is a flamethrower dude was up here. I mean, I guess we got one shilling and some other some other stuff. Any enemy card. Press L3 to spot enemies around and display their enemy cards. Okay, resistances. There are four types. There's melee, range, blood, and shadow. Stuff sees resist to. Orange indicates a medium. Red indicates high. So basically, he's good against gun bullets. Don't try to use gun bullets. His best stuff would be my vampire attacks. Where's that other dude at? There were two of them out here. He might be clear over by that door over there. Yeah. Let's just uh, straight up. Steady boy. Yeah. I didn't mean to do that, but I shouldn't have said nothing because it looked like I did. All right. Shotgun shells in a lead plate. Huh, I wonder where he was keeping that. Right. Well, I almost feel like I should switch buttons up now, but I imagine by the end of the game I'll, uh, I'm down. Alright, we need to try to go for a stun next time. Oh! I think I know where we're at. Alright, uh, yeah. Anywho, uh, get my vampire bite. Ah ha, right in front of your friend! Oh crap, crap. Oh, they don't. Now I'm dancing too much. Stamina. Oh, he can shoot me through there? Yeah, give me that blood. Mmm, delicious. Alright, as long as I remember to spam square, I shouldn't <laughs> keep using my vampire powers immediately after I bite him. Alright, give me your purses. And where are some rats? Alright, new practices, new techniques. Alright, that, whatever. Let's see if I can't find it. I thought that, that button says details, so. Uh, is it? No, we did that one. There's some other letters, maybe? Here we go. Alright, oh, we love reading. Alright, new practices, new tactics. I know that some of our companies consider that the best advantage we have in our fight against leeches is that we can't go out during the day. Thus, we can hunt them down when they hide, powerless in their sleep. This is a rookie mistake. First, because vampires are clever and they have countless ruses and tricks to avoid being spotted in their den. Second, because they deploy many deadly traps to kill any intruders in what they consider their most precious sanctuary. It would cost us too much men and too much time to explore and eradicate vampires in their hideouts. The best tactic is to follow and destroy them when they really are vulnerable, when they hunt at night. It is much easier to attack them then, for they can easily be spotted. That's why the guard of Prywin must evolve and deploy new tactics to hunt leeches. 
small and mobile patrols, tactics based on technological advantages, modern communications, we can learn many things from the war in France. New strategy, new equipment, and new weaponry. Grenades, white phosphorus, ultraviolet light, bulletproof vest, and flamethrower, it is a time for the guard to embrace the 20th century. From a new war by Jeffrey McCollum, Prywin leader. All right. There was a uh, flamethrower dude, like, right out here. But I, I don't know if maybe we might be able to walk right behind him. Yeah, there he is. We can sneak up on him. That's why we didn't go that way. I thought I might be able to get him from a different angle. All right. Bullets. Haven't used one yet, but we got some more. Right. Whee! What do we have here? Got a little... Ooh, used... Is that an L or an I? Lupera? Eupera? Whatever. Looks like some sort of sh short-ended shotgun. Okay. Alright, so there's something else over here still. Let's see what's here. While we're up here, might as well uh, check up on this side. Oh. Oh, okay. Let's bite him. We still need a little bit more blood. Over there. Yeah, give me it. Delicious. know if there's a uh, difficulty setting I imagine this being the uh, same company that made life is strange I imagine they don't have a difficulty level for this game but I didn't see one when we started and you know obviously it's usually one of the first things you come across okay let's go get our flame buddy I mean I really don't need to sneak up on him but oh we can Long button. All right. Let's just let's run up on it and see what happens. Nope, he hears me. There we go. Give me that purse. I feel like I'm mugging all these poor individuals, taking all their purses. All right. So I think they want me to go somewhere behind me. Rats and hideouts. Rats are often located near hideouts. Using senses, L3 will help you locate them more easily. Oh, uh, I see him over that blood pool. Okay. Well, we're full on health. These rats will survive. For now. That must be a hideout. Okay. Uh, whoop! I only have 190 XP? What the heck? Hideout unlocked. Alrighty. Let's check our luggage. Or our little case. A refill. Haven't used any. Just testing it. Alrighty. Oh, some shillings. Uh, yada yada. There's the bed, of course. Oh, I thought that was the workbench. There's our, some sort of guy on the ground. We will inspect him in a second. Okay, we said we weren't going to break apart anything. Highly doubt I can upgrade anything this early on. Yeah, okay, so here we go. Used Lupara. Lupara or something. Fire rate. Reload time. Way more damage, but you have to be pretty close to the magazine. Okay. Oh, I thought I could equip it to a certain spot, but I probably can put it in one of these other... Where are we at? There we go. Oh, those are serums. These are probably other powers. Yeah. You know what, though? Let's uh, kind of... I'd rather you... If I'm going to use a gun, I want to test it out first. All right. There's the bed. Can we go downstairs? I didn't see an option. Nope, looks pretty, pretty messed up. All right, taking his wallet. And what is, why is everyone carrying around lead plates? All right, that, I don't think we can level. Like 300 would be the closest we could do. All right, there's our rat friends. Following the trail. How far does it say this thing is? Must be right around the corner then. North dock. Cause that red circle's about to we're about to be outside of it. Fresh blood. The whole building reeks of it. The huh? scent is so strong it makes me dizzy. Lead rod. Pretty sure I can still see it in his chest, but you know, it's game. As one we shall overcome this. Ooh. Use scythe. 
two-handed weapons. Equip a two-handed weapon and press triangle to use its special ability. The scythe, for instance, can be used to parry an incoming attack, inflicting heavy stun damage if timed correctly. Oh, maybe we should learn how to use it. Okay. Uh, is it the bag? No, oh, it's is it in my face every time? Let's uh okay. Does it take up just one spot? Oh, sweet, okay, cool. That should be left and right. Oh, I see what happened. Well, hold on. Okay, yeah, that it's showing that it takes up both spots, so I, I no longer can do my stun stake uh, when I have the scythe or use a gun for that matter. Alright, let's let's get this ball rolling. This place reeks of bloodshed. Who's talking? Oh, some people over there. Let's just do a quick Oh, they, Please, let go they will not. That's Sean. We know his name without ever meeting him. Okay, uh, won't let me do the uh, detective mode. Witcher sense. Can't stand it anymore. This creature is bedeviled. Oh, is I it? Must put it down. Okay. Take this, William Bishop. Attacking while his back's turned. That's probably what they want us to. Let's try. Ah, oh, I tried to hit triangle in. He did a different attack to us. Let's try it again. Ow! Oh, there. Was that the stun? I don't know. They gotta hold the triangle. Whatever. Let's just finish him off. Have to read that again. Used bludgeon. So did we just randomly gain this from him? Whatever. Uh, yeah, sorry, bud. But he's just gonna get back up if he's a vampire. Alright, so here's how I heal myself. Uh, what is the button? L1. Alright, it gives me a little bit. Let's do it again. Check a bit. Come on, give me all the way. At least it actually doesn't take that much. But to use that during combat would be pretty difficult. Oh, I don't know. Okay, that's attack. So this is what they wanted me to do, is this. Must be a parry. I thought I was uh, timing it correctly. I don't know why. I'm supposed to stun him for a lot, it said. Alright. Oh, it wants me to check that victim. I forgive you. The Lord is my shepherd. So that's Sean. I'm guessing that was William Bishop that we just beat up, but I really think that that's not how you, Oh, he is one ugly motherfucker. Uh, sorry for the language, kids. Okay. There we go. William was an honorable man. I could have saved him. No, you couldn't have. Mr. Hampton, are you in there? We knew him well. Another lost soul, a kindred spirit. Sir. Listen to the sound of my voice. I am... I am a doctor. You're suffering from shock. Oh, oh shit! Return to my flock, they stray without me. Stake him! Oh. Is that a lady? She was Remember, probably talking to Swansea. Remember, certain are every bit as resistant as we are. Who are you? She's what another vampire! Skull. You truly are a newborn. I should have realized... Wait. You, you are the woman from the bar. Are you... like me? Can you help me? I believe, sir, I already have. Yes, she got a point. Hey, whoa! Look at the games on that lady. She can jump far with them legs. Let's get you out of here, Sean. By George and the Saints, you've solved the mystery of these terrible murders. Oh, well, look who happened to show up at the right time. Patience, good fellows, I've come to offer help. Oh, Just I'm getting this like twins Bioshock both. Infinity vibe from him. Place. William was not the evil man they claimed. He was just taken by the thirst. He needed his drink. This man requires I'm medical attention. Get some Saints from see, him. He gets to the nearest hospital. No, please, I almost tend to my fault. My flock needs me. Yes. Go with a good Dr. Swansea. He's resourceful, and I'm sure he'll take good care of you. You'd best come as well. The sun is soon to rise, and you'll need a place to rest. 
I like I that Dr. Swansea, that's a good name. If I can learn something about what has happened to William, I'll be a step closer to understanding what happened to me. Okay, but don't take too long. All right, where is he at? Oh, there he is. Uh, yep, don't need to do a quick sweep. All right, we gained this back. Any glowy looking stuff stands out. Maybe over there, but it looks like it's just fire. Okay, let's inspect Mr. William Bishop. This poor creature can't be my maker. Could it be some sub vampire? Okay, I should have waited until he finished the sentence. A fresh sample of William's Bishop's blood in a small tube. Species of vampire. I must find a place to analyze the blood. Okay, board the boat. Uh, you know what? That's a good place to stop. So that'll do it for episode three. I'm Happy Tangent. Loving the fact that we're playing a different game from that last hellish game I played. Uh, really enjoying it. I really enjoyed Life is Strange from Don't Nod. Uh, this so far in this first uh, hour plus we played. Really like it. Uh, we'll see you in the next episode. Please like and subscribe and we'll keep making these videos.